All right, so this is probably the most common question that I get, and that is, Jesse, I don't wanna go through your five-day course. I don't wanna learn really anything about this business. Just tell me which music library should I send my music to? Just give me a name, give me a website. I just wanna know who it is so that I can submit to them and get my career started. You guys know that most of the time, I don't like that question for a very specific reason, and you probably know that. But I have a treat for you. Today, I'm gonna to tell you, okay? I don't care who you are, what kind of music you make. I don't know who you are watching this video right now, but I will tell you, specifically you watching this video, which music library you should submit to. I bet you didn't think I was gonna do that, right? So write this company name down. Okay, are you ready? I'll wait for a second. Again, you don't wanna miss out on this. This library is the best library for you. Whatever genre of music you make, whatever your goals are, whatever you're trying to get into on which side of the licensing business, doesn't matter. The company, you have something to write down with? The company that you should submit to and partner with is Music Company. Did you catch it? Did you write it down? Okay, I'll repeat it one more time, okay? I gotta make sure that you are understanding that I am giving you a specific company here so that I should never get this question ever again, okay? You've watched this video, you know who you should send your music to. The company's name is Company. Got it, right? So go ahead and visit their website, submit your music, because that is the company that you need to be partnering with. All right, hopefully you didn't punch a hole in your screen when you were frustrated because you couldn't hear the name of the company. Okay, that was obviously on purpose. And I'm just having a little bit of a goof, okay? Having a little bit of fun with you guys. I still get this question all the time and it's such, I mean, I, I get it because if you just now learned about music licensing, you probably don't know what I actually would honestly, legitly say, no sarcasm involved, what I would actually respond to something like that. It depends. There is no such thing as the right company or the right music library or the best library for you to partner with because what kind of music do you make? What genre do you specialize in? What kind of placements are you trying to get into? Reality TV, uh, commercials, promos, trailers, films, um, uh, streaming, online stuff. There's so many different areas that you can get into and every library has their own relationships built up and every library has its own catalog and genres of music and different needs. You guys understand that for me to have to keep a tabs on 200 plus companies out there, probably 300 plus companies, at least just in the US alone, that are collecting music, for me to keep on top of all of those to find out, okay, well, what music do you make? Okay, you should partner with them. What, what do you do? Okay, well, because they their checks are the, uh, every library's catalog evolves from month to month, from year to year. They change their needs of what they're working with. Um, and so I just, there's not enough time in the day for me to be able to do that. And you, need to be the CEO of your own music career. You need to put in that work yourself, okay? You need to do the research yourself. You need to go out there and study these catalogs of these libraries that you wanna to submit to. Are your tracks on par with the, ca the quality that they currently have? Do you have maybe a style of music that they don't currently have? Maybe they're in use of it. Or maybe they have a lot of your style, but your genres and your, um, your production quality is actually higher than what they currently hold in their catalog. That's how you're gonna get an in, okay? So again, this is one of those things I can provide guidance for the industry about how it works and how to maintain a long-term income stream through it. But deciding who to partner with, who to do work with, I'm not your manager, right? I'm not gonna go do uh, that homework for you. That is for you to do. And you should care enough about your own career to do a little bit of research for yourself, okay? If I could have done it, you can do it as well. It doesn't take that long. Um, I do have a music library directory that takes out at least the big chunk of work, which is just finding these companies. How do you even find them? And they're all in a PDF <clears throat> with clickable links and websites you can click on instantly and listen to their catalogs if they have a catalog online. And I'd say 80 to 90% of them do play their music online. So you can actually find that stuff. So again, sorry for the practical prank, practical joke there, but I hopefully drove home the point to you and uh, hopefully fewer and fewer times I'm gonna be getting this question that you need to answer that question for yourself through your own research.